Hello, friends. So, so far, what we have observed in uh, UI path, uh, sorry, in um, Process Studio, that we need to add a calculation stage for doing any kind of uh, calculation. So, if you want to add two numbers and then you want to subtract two numbers, every time we need to add a calculation stage. However, uh, in uh, Process Studio, there is another stage that we call as um, multiple calculation states that would be used where we can perform set of operations that uh, could be carried out at one go and that will help out to make your business process very simple. So let us see how we can use the multiple calculation stage in process studio. Uh, create a process Let us take a small example. We have three variables defined in Java, let it be. And I want to say A equal to 90, B equal to 39, then I am saying increment A, B, plus plus then C equal to A plus C then integer D equal to C then D plus plus so these are the few operations so you have declared three variables and uh, you have assigned some default value to A and B now you want to increase then you want to increase then uh, you want to add two numbers to C, you want to assign. So that's a simple logic. Now these statements need to be executed one after another. So in this situation, we can use the multi-calculation stage. So let us define few variables. R1 will hold number where 2 will hold number, where 3 will again hold number, where 4 it will also hold. Now we will use the multi calculation. Let me assign some default value to where 1 and where to okay now if you open the properties of multiple calculation then let me give some meaningful name multiple statements and the first statement in my program is a plus plus so here I can write an expression for a plus plus. I am saying variable one plus one. I want to store the output into a. It is an increment within a, so I will assign the value into store in where one. Then b plus plus. I will add another row. And I will mention var2 plus 1. And again, I will say var2. Then I will add var1 and 2 and store the value into var3. var1 plus var2. Okay. Then I am assigning the value of C to D. I will add another row. I will add C and I will assign this value. So these are the values, these are the operations which would be executed in this order. And I press OK. 
and uh, let me expand it. Let me link it. and run it so you will see the value of var1 which was 12 and incremented for 13 original value assigned to var2 33 got incremented with 34 and 13 plus 34 is 47 and 47 var3 is assigned to var4 in this way, you can execute multiple statements using the multiple calculation stage. So this is very simple and make your life easy. If you have any doubts, then please do connect me at sureshkumarmadra at yahoo.com. Thanks for watching this video. Bye.